Tyson Fury looks remarkably sharp and in top physical form as he prepares for the upcoming heavyweight title bout against Oleksandr Usyk next month. Meanwhile, Usyk has displayed minimal interest in Fury's training regimen, underscoring his unwavering focus on his own preparations for the fight. Listen, I not see uh, Instagram and uh, Facebook. Uh, I not see video uh, with uh, Tyson Fury. Usyk has also brushed off his critics, expressing confidence that his diligent efforts will pay off come May 18th. Me, all Usyk have bad style, maybe good, doesn't matter. I like. My style is great style. With your preparation. Former professional boxer Duke McKenzie maintains the belief that Alexander Yusik enters this fight as the superior boxer. He further asserts that the Ukrainian fighter demonstrates greater determination and readiness compared to the Gypsy King. Much more complete all-round fighter. I don't think he, I don't think Fury's boxed anybody like him. And Uzik would be so up for this fight. And a good Alexander Uzik probably holds his own with just about every. Anticipation runs high in the boxing world as all eyes turn to the most significant match of 2024, fueled by Tyson Fury's latest training footage. But what does Usyk reveal about his opponent, and what are the experts predicting? Follow along as we explore these questions setting the stage for the epic showdown between Tyson Fury and Oleksandr Yusyk, hailed as the pinnacle event in boxing this year. Despite criticism for delaying the fight, Fury's recent training footage unveils a profound transformation, showcasing his unwavering commitment. While Fury's tactics may seek to unsettle Yusyk, the Ukrainian remains steadfast, unruffled by the psychological warfare. Listen, I not see uh, Instagram and uh, Facebook. Uh, I not see video uh, with uh, Tyson Fury. When probed about his response to Fury's recent training footage, Alexander Yusik remained notably unfazed. The Ukrainian pugilist emphasized his disinterest in social media theatrics and the mind games often associated with it. Yusik's approach to the impending showdown reflects a mindset deeply rooted in discipline, dedication, and a deliberate avoidance of the distractions rampant in the digital realm. His reaction to Tyson Fury's training snippets not only underscores his disdain for psychological maneuvers, but also signifies a broader ethos that could mold his career and boxing methodology in an age dominated by online chatter. Yusik's remarks in his Seconds Out interview encapsulate this traditionalist stance. I don't dwell on Instagram or Facebook. My focus is solely on my craft. His unwavering commitment to training stands as a testament to his adherence to the sport's fundamental values. By sidestepping the customary pre-fight verbal jousting and psychological warfare prevalent on social media, Yusik sets himself apart as a fighter whose gaze remains steadfastly fixed on the physical and mental rigors demanded of a true champion. Yusik's aloofness towards social media theatrics isn't merely about brushing aside distractions, it's a strategic stance spotlighting his mental resilience in a sport where psychological strength is as vital as physical prowess. By sidestepping online conflicts and staying fixated on his training and tactics, Yusik could potentially gain a psychological upper hand over adversaries ensnared in social media melodrama. This disciplined approach ensures that Yusik channels all his energy into refining his skills fine-tuning his strategy, and bolstering his physical fitness. It also unveils a profound self-awareness and understanding of what it takes to excel in the build-up to a fight. Yusik recognizes that triumphing in the ring often hinges on the quiet moments of preparation, far removed from the clamor of social media. His commitment to intellectual pursuits, particularly delving into psychology literature and studying influential figures like former Ukrainian President Kuchma, underscores his determination to fortify his mind alongside his physique, fully equipping himself for the impending showdown against Fury. For me, all Usyk have bad style, maybe good, doesn't matter. I like. My style is great style. Usyk didn't just shrug off the training footage on social media, he also issued a direct warning to Tyson Fury. With confidence, he asserted the superiority of his boxing style, and predicted that Fury would realize this during their May 18th fight. This warning isn't just a casual remark, it adds an extra layer of anticipation to their upcoming bout. It's not merely about the physical aspect of the fight, it's a psychological challenge aimed squarely at Fury. 
Yusik's confidence in his stylistic edge over Fury sets the stage for a clash that goes beyond the usual pre-fight hype, delving into the intricate elements of boxing artistry and strategy that define legends. Yusik's claim of stylistic superiority is intriguing for several reasons. Firstly, it prompts Fury, known for his own unconventional and adaptable fighting style, to confront a boxer unafraid of his accomplishments or physical stature. As a former undisputed cruiserweight champion who seamlessly transitioned to heavyweight, Yusik possesses a unique combination of speed, agility, and technical skill that has troubled opponents across weight divisions. His confidence suggests he has pinpointed vulnerabilities in Fury's style that he intends to exploit, adding an intriguing tactical dimension to their encounter. Furthermore, Yusik's warning to Fury represents a bold move in the mental tactics leading up to major fights, asserting the superiority of his style. It's a strategic maneuver aimed at establishing psychological dominance, placing pressure on Fury to refute his claim. This psychological aspect plays a pivotal role in elite-level boxing, where confidence and self-belief can be as crucial as landing a precise punch. The strategic matchup between these two fighters adds depth to Yusik's warning. Fury, with his towering stature and unexpected agility, has consistently outperformed some of the heavyweight division's most formidable opponents. Conversely, Yusik's speed and technical expertise, honed in the cruiserweight division and tested against heavyweight power, present a unique challenge for Fury. The anticipation surrounding how these contrasting styles will collide on May 18th is palpable. Yusik's warning also elevates the fight beyond mere physicality, transforming it into a clash of ideologies. The agile, precise technician versus the towering, adaptable warrior encapsulates the intricate dynamics of boxing, where victory often depends on the subtle nuances of style, strategy, and preparation. Let's not forget about the Gypsy King, the WBC heavyweight champion, as he shouldn't be underestimated due to the significant effort he's putting into his training. Recent snapshots and videos reveal the British heavyweight appearing more trim than ever, igniting excitement among fans as both fighters gear up for the upcoming bout just weeks away. Despite Fury's resurgence, experts remain doubtful about his ability to knock out the Ukrainian. Former pro boxer Duke McKenzie, respected for his insights, believes Yusik could outshine any current heavyweight, including Tyson Fury. McKenzie's opinion holds weight for several reasons. Firstly, it stems from his deep understanding of the sport, recognizing Yusik's unmatched technical skill, agility, and strategic brilliance as qualities that set him apart in the heavyweight division. Yusik's smooth transition to heavyweight underscores his adaptability, overcoming size and power differentials with his superior boxing intellect and relentless dedication. Much more complete all-round fighter. I don't think he, I don't think Fury's boxed anybody like him. And Uzik would be so up for this fight. And a good Alexander Uzik probably holds his own with just about every any heavyweight. That's McKenzie's prediction sheds light on the challenge ahead for Tyson Fury, known for his exceptional skill set and adaptability. Fury has dominated the heavyweight scene with his blend of size, agility, and ring intelligence. McKenzie's assertion suggests that Yusik's unique attributes could present a formidable challenge to Fury's reign. Moreover, McKenzie's statement adds intrigue to the fight, hinting that the outcome may depend on more than just physical abilities. If Yusik can effectively utilize his speed, footwork, and precision against Fury's size and strength, the bout could indeed validate McKenzie's forecast. Many experts, including Frank Warren, believe Yusik will target Fury's recent cut above his eye sustained during sparring. While Warren acknowledges Yusik's intentions to exploit the wound, he remains confident in Fury's ability to withstand such tactics. Pointing to Fury's previous victories despite severe cuts, Warren emphasizes Fury's resilience and ability to adapt to adversity. He highlights Fury's knack for exploiting opponents' vulnerabilities, suggesting that if anyone can capitalize on weaknesses in this fight, it will be Fury. Warren doesn't dismiss Yusik's capabilities, acknowledging that he may identify areas to exploit based on Fury's previous fights. However, Warren remains convinced that Fury will ultimately capitalize on Yusik's weaknesses, as he did with previous opponents. He references Daniel Dubois as an example of an opponent who attempted to exploit Fury's vulnerabilities 
but ultimately fell short. In great nick, which means you're going to get speed, you're going to get power, and you're going to get a vintage, vintage Tyson Fury in that ring. So do you think will he will stop him? He will knock him out. Warren predicts Fury will win by knockout, akin to his victory over Welder. The clash between two undefeated fighters, set for the 18th, promises excitement. Share your predictions in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications for more updates. Thanks for watching. See you next time.